has sent people. Teach the, car teach the Scientology version, which states that the world was created on a bet between God and L. Ron Hubbard. <laughs> And some of you are skeptical, I think, <laughs> by nature, and what you might, might need is a little lesson in creation science. Here we go. God made the world in seven days. Well, that's one week to be specific. That's what I call scientific. Say hallelujah, St. Fred, 4042 B.C. On Monday, August 27th, he made the earth and the sky and the heaven. Then he punched out at Bible 3, then he made Adam and then Eve. A garden for them to inhabit, the apple right where Eve could grab it. I got proof because I believe in creation signs. <laughs> well, one in the beginning it begun. And you are just beginning to educate yourself when you shun evolution. Then Cain and Abel, he began. And they began all of the rest to us. They must have been incestuous. I'm going to have to pray about that. There might be sinners in this class. Who might believe in Charles Darwin? I guess that's just their loss of Darwin. Because I'm going to flood their ass if you make Genesis your text. You'll laugh at Darwin and what he sees origin of species because he's just plain over sex creation science 101 you ain't no monkey's great grandson you've got a research paper to about the 50 reasons to shun evolution Survival of the fittest. That notion don't pass the bullshit test. Cause look at me, I'm still alive. God made the world just like it is. He made the fossils just to tease us. Old bones to test our faith in Jesus. Yeah, this will all be on the quiz creation site. 101. Spontaneous genetic mutation. 